Hey guys, it's Archie Luxury. Archie Luxury from the Archie Luxury channel, the Paul Pluter channel, and Archie Luxury Corporate. Guys, keep watching, keep watching. I need the viewers. I need the viewers, I need the subs, I need it. Like, subscribe, and tell your friends. Tell your friends, whether you like them or hate them. Just tell them anyhow. Archie Luxury on YouTube. Hi guys, Archie Luxury on the Paul Pluter channel. We're doing paid review 20 SE44. This is for Dave. Now Dave is a very cool guy. He has actually, Dave has bought me a present. He's a, I want to say to David, thank you so much. He got me a beautiful scotch. Look at this. Chivas Regal, 12 years old. One of my favorite scotches. I love Chivas Regal. Is 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 uh, one of my all-time. Just a beautifully blended, nice scotch. Cannot cannot fault Chivas Regal. And I want to say thank you so much. Now he's also paid me for review. Hi Arch. Quick, 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 quick. With watch check. We're in the paddock. Five one nine six. Five one nine six. Yellow gold. Manual wine. Hi Arch, you're my number one YouTube star and watching your videos let me both learn about watches and have good advice from my for my life. At the moment I don't have a new watch review to request so I'd like to ask for a fictional show. I'm sending you some money. Here's the prologue. Let's imagine a thief stole all your watches. Actually I just put them in the bank safe today for that very reason. I did. I know, too bad, too bad, too bad. But on the same day, you have won the lottery. US, 2 million US dollars. Yes, 2 million US macaroonies. How would Art spend the 2 million? Where would you live? And of course, what watches would you buy? Have fun and thanks for everything, Dave. 2 million US dollars. Wowzers! Wowzers. That's a amazing question. That's an amazing question. And I gotta tell you, man, two million bucks would solve my problems in life. That two million US dollars, my god, that'd be absolutely amazing. Now let's have a look. What would I do? Uh and that's that's a very good question. So so what would I buy? Two million US dollars. Now I'm just going to convert that into Aussie because I want to have this fantasy. Normally I think in Aussie dollars. I just want to know how many Aussie dollars that is. Two million, one, two, three, one, two, three, six zeros. Two million US into Aussie. Let's have a look. Into Aussie. Let's have a look. That is 2.8, 2.8 Aussie, 2.8, wow. And that is also, let's just put that into perspective for our UK in Great British Pounds, that would be 1.5 million pounds, okay. So what would I do, what would I do, okay, okay, I'll tell you what I'd do. So, so let's get the fundamentals out, firstly, I would buy I would buy I would buy an apartment in Brisbane because I'm sick of having a yard and that there I I I I I'd, I'd, I'd get an apartment okay I want an apartment I want two bed two bedroom two bathroom cuz I could have a studio in one and my bedroom in the other now I reckon that would cost me, that would cost me about, I could get a two bedroom apartment in Brisbane. I reckon a really nice one, $650,000. The next thing I would do is, I would get a second apartment, two bed, two bath, at the Gold Coast. That's right, I'd buy one at the Gold Coast. I think five hundred hundred thousand dollars would set me right there 
okay okay so so that that would be 1.15 Aussie 1.15 I would then I would then invest a bit in shares yeah I would I would I would probably I would probably shares okay let's work this out I'd probably put in I reckon I would put 500 in shares cash I'd like to keep a little bit in cash I'd probably in cash I would have let's just make it 150 150 okay uh, so now let's have a look there we got 1.15 okay so so let's just work this out there 1 million 1 million of this is numbers are crazy 1 million that's uh, 1 million then we got 7 8 1.8 1.8 so far I've spent 1.8 so two apartments one at the Gold Coast one in Brisbane a share portfolio a bit of cash so I've got 1 million Aussie 1 million left what would I do with that 1 million what would I do with that 1 million good question I'd have to get a, I'd have to get a car yeah I'd get a car what would I get? What would I get? E three hundred Mercedes Benz. E three hundred Mercedes. Okay. Okay. I reckon I get a second hand one. Demonstrator hundred K. And I'd get a Porsche. A Porsche. Boxster. A Boxster. Bike it. Get a Boxster, man. Get a, I'd get a Boxster. 718. I think 100K would get. Okay, so that's 200K. Okay, so now I got 800 left. Okay, now 800k, 800k left, 800k, you know what I'd like to do, I'd like to get, I'd like to buy an apartment around the corner and put my two adult sons in okay so I reckon three hundred and fifty K okay three hundred and fifty so that would make it I got four fifty left to spend on watches four hundred and fifty thousand dollars left to spend on watches Four hundred and fifty thousand. Okay, so what would I buy for that? Okay, okay, that's a good question. Four hundred and fifty. Ah, very good question. Okay, so let, let's have a think on that. What would I, what would I buy? Okay, so firstly, uh, what would I buy? What do I really want to have? Four hundred and fifty. You can get a beautiful collection for four fifty thousand. I think. I think. I think 450,000 what would I buy what would I buy what would I buy I think okay I would get a 6006 I want that back okay that's not big money I can get one of those second hand 25 US which is 35 RZ I'd want a 5196 I just love that watch there I get one of those for 20 RZ Okay, that's fifty five that's fifty, fifty thousand, say fifty, fifty. So I got four hundred left. 
I think I'd also want I'd also want a five one three zero, which would be about forty Aussie. That's the I got the five one one zero, but I'd go for the bigger one. I think the five one three zero, its dial is not as nice, but it's I reckon there's upside on that watch. What other Patek would I want there? I'd get a 5396. 5396. 5396. 5396. That'll probably set me back 50. 50,000 second hand. So let's have a look there. 90, 110. 145. So 100, make it 150. So 150. So I got 300, uh, 300 left. What would I buy with three hundred thousand uh, dollars? So that's one, two, three, four Pateks. I think that's enough. Ah! I tell you what I'd do. I tell you what I'd do. I'd also get. I'd also get, I would also get a 5960, 5960, that would probably set me back, what are they, $50,000, 50, okay, 50k, so that means 200, 200, so I got, I've got 150 left. 150 left. 150 left. 300. 250 left. 250 left. 250 left. 250 left. 250 Aussie. 250. How much is that in US? Because let's go on to David SW. One, two, three. Two hundred and fifty Aussie dollars into US. Okay, so this this is getting down to nuts and tax here. Hundred and seventy-seven thousand. Okay, so what would I buy? Hundred and seventy-seven thousand. I tell you what I'd buy. I would buy. What would I buy? What would I buy? Hundred and I got a hundred and seventy-seven. One seventy-seven US. Okay, so what would I buy for a hundred and seventy-seven thousand uh, dollars? Okay, so what would I want to buy there? I'd want to buy. <laughs> I'd get the the GMT root beer, the one two six seven one five. That's forty k. Okay, that's the gold GMT. Okay, I want one of those. That's forty thousand dollars. I also want. I want a Pepsi. I want a Pepsi. I want a steel Pepsi. Pepsi would be twenty grand. Okay, he's got David S W. has got that for twenty U S. I want a Pepsi. Yeah, I want a Pepsi. I want a Pepsi. I want a Pepsi. I want a Pepsi. Okay. Then I want. Okay, so then. Then I'd want uh, submariners. What I want in submariners? I'll tell you what I want in submariners. Uh, I'd get the solid gold. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, do I want the 41? No, I'd go for the standard. The double one, double six, one eight. That's going to cost me 30, 35, 35, 35. So I'm not paying ten grand more for the new subby. I'd also want. I also want a bluesy, a bluesy, fifteen k. Let's get a. Let's get a bluesy, fifteen k. Okay, bluesy. Okay. Uh, so that's. Okay, that's what I want to get. 
what else do I want to get there? So, so I tell you what, guys, we're getting strong. Solid gold Ever Rose GMT. It's forty thousand US David SW. I want to get a Pepsi. That's twenty thousand. I want a solid gold blue dial Submariner. Not not the latest one, but the the, the ceramic. That's thirty five. And then I want to get a two tone bluesy. That's fifteen. So what have we got there? So that's uh, sixty. 60 plus 15 is 75, 75, 80, 110, 110, I got 60, 60 grand left US to spend, what else would I buy, 60,000 US to spend, I tell you what I'd do, I tell you what I'd do, I would get a Daytona, I want a Daytona, what would I get, what would I get, What would I get? Fike it. Let's get a panda. I get a pa Oh, they're expensive. Maserati blue. Look at that. 20,000 US. Yes, I'll take that. 20,000 for the Maserati blue dial. I'll get that instead. That's, that's better buying. Um, okay, so that, that leaves me there. 130. 130. 130 so I got about 50,000 you know what I do I would actually each of my kids I would get them a Rolex each hundred and so I, I I'd get them I'd get them what would I get them I get my youngest two a pair of oyster perpetuals they could get a, two oyster perpetuals and the older two I reckon I get them an Explorer 2 each. Explorer 2 each, 40 mil, 42 mil, 42 mil, two black dials. Okay, that's 10 each roughly. And for the younger two kids, I'd get them two Oyster Perpetuals. There you go, $2 million. All I gotta do is come up with the readies and all my problems are solved. I'm Archie Luxury, tell me what you think, like, subscribe, tell your friends. Don't be afraid to put some comments. Tell me what you, what do you think of that? What do you think of that? Two million dollars? Ah, it's relief for the brain. Guys, I can't survive on Google Ads alone. I depend on paid reviews to keep me going. Without these paid reviews, I would sink. Guys, 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 guys. Please, guys, 50 US dollars. I'll do a watch review for you. I need your help. Google's is garbage. I need your help. I'm your partner. Tell me what you guys think of that. Nice one, Arch. Two mil! That'd solve all my problems. Hi, guys. Archie Luxury. And who do I recommend in America? In America, who do I recommend for quality pre-owned wristwatches? David SW, David SW, David SW. Go to davidsw.com. He is the best the greatest pre-owned dealer in all of the United States of America. David SW, David SW, David SW. Hey guys, Archie Luxury. Who do I recommend for watches in Brisbane and Sydney? Vintage Watch Co. That's correct. Vintage Watch Co. In Brisbane Arcade in Brisbane and the Strand Arcade in Sydney. Vintage Watch Co, Brisbane and Sydney. Ronnie, I've known him since the late 90s. Ronnie is a top bloke. Luke is a great guy. Vintage Watch Co, that is who I recommend in Australia. Check out Vintage Watch Co and the guys' amazing range of watches. They also do service and repairs. Vintage Watch Co, that is where the pontiff goes. You know, some of my paddocks came from Vintage Watch Co. That's right, guys. Vintage Watch Co.